everyone and welcome back to Moss Tree Village. Oh gosh, and it's another beautiful day here. Oh my goodness, look at, oh, there's a little bug. Oh my gosh, there's there's a little mouse. Oh my goodness, there's so much going on. Okay, so first things first, let's, oh, if I could catch this bug. No, I missed him again, he's in my flowers. Oh my gosh, come back here. Come back here, little guy. Oh, how can I not catch him? It must be, oh, I got my net caught on something. All right, so I wasn't able to catch that bug. Well, that's kind of hilarious that he eluded me. And we have something to dig up in our front yard. And it looks like we have a new villager and there's Caesar and we have some mail. So <laughs> there's a lot going on in Moss Tree Village today. So let's go ahead and start by checking our mail. Maybe I have a note because I'm the mayor. Oh, there's so much mail. Oh my gosh. Okay, so let's go ahead and read what we've got hidden away in here. Okay, so mail, what's going on here? <gasps> Isabel sent me something. Dear Mayor Siri, I've attached some wallpaper to celebrate your move here. Please try hanging it by putting it in your pocket, selecting the wallpaper, and choose Hang On Wall from Isabel. Thank you, Isabel. She's so sweet about trying to make sure I'm properly set up for everything. And then the HH Showcase. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Dear homeowner, welcome to the Happy Home Academy. All members can use our Happy Home Showcase, but please be sure to visit us when you please be sure to get visit us when you get a chance at some point. Awesome! I think that's the place a little bit further north of Main Street, so I'll have to go and check that in a little bit. And then a gift from Tabby! Yay! Tabby! Kind, generous Siri. It was so sweet of you to compliment my dingy place. And actually, I did pop by Tabby's place yesterday and I visited her for a little bit. And there's a new villager. It looks like a mouse, a cheddar mouse. I think we did have a place that said cheddar was going to move in. So we'll go check out cheddar in just a second. But I did pop in and I thought about recording it, but I just kind of went in and enjoyed looking around Tabby's home, which is pretty awesome, by the way. And I actually bought a really nice palm tree, a lady palm. There's that bug again. A lady palm from Tabby. Abby. So that was really fun and I can't wait to visit the villagers more with you guys so we can start building up a sense of the story that my town has and that the villagers have in my town because that's really really important to me is to build that kind of story cohesion through everything we do. But anyway, next time you come over you won't even know you were in the same house. Promise! At <laughs> And take this for my as my thanks. You rock from Tabby. Oh, that's so cool. I really liked visiting with Tabby. So what kind of present did she give us? All right, let's go ahead and open it. What is it? <gasps> a manhole cover? I don't know. I don't know how to take that. Like my house is a sewer or something. I'll have to think about that. Okay, and we're going to go ahead and take the present from Isabel. And she has given us some, oh, some paw print wallpaper. That sounds so cute. All right, I'm going to have to go ahead and empty my mail, I think. So is there a way to do that? Okay, that was from my mom. I can go ahead and toss that. And then this was from Isabel. Go ahead and toss that. Happy home showcase. And then I'll keep the one from Tabby for a little while because that makes me happy. I wonder if I can mail Tabby back. All right. So first things first. Actually, we already checked the mail. That was first. Okay. Second thing second. We're going to go ahead and introduce ourselves as the mayor to this new resident of my town. I am wearing the red tulips of introduction or the red lilies of socialization. So whenever I socialize with the villagers, I'll wear the red lilies in my hair. All right. Let's go ahead and introduce ourselves. Chatter! Hey, I haven't met you yet. I'm Chatter. I'm moving into town recently. But who are you? Wait, you're Siri, right? Everyone says you have a ton of influence on this town. I'm impressed. Well, don't be a stranger, okay? I have a good feeling about you, Siri. Oh, thank you, Chatter. I love your ears. They're so cute and polka dotted. How goes it, Siri? If I may be so bold, you're looking as cool as a fair number of cucumbers. Thank you, Chatter. This is actually my mayor outfit. I wear this when out and about doing mayoral duties. If you see me wearing my chef outfit, then I'm out and about collecting up peaches to sell them for peach jam to help fund the town projects. All right, talk to me, Chatter. It feels kind of lonely since there aren't any events to celebrate, don't you think? Formage? <laughs> Formage. At times like this, you should plan your own fun event, Siri. For example, an interview with Chatter, or Chatter invites himself to your house. Oh, but, uh, please don't plan anything like wake up prank on Chatter. I hate that event. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's very nice to meet you, Chatter, and good morning, Caesar. I see that you've come to visit me again. Actually, was it Caesar? He gave me the scale, I think. No, that was Big Top, maybe. How about this weather, huh? It's like the sun's taking a shine to us. Yeah, get it, Highness? So, what's up? Alright, you want to chat? 
I've been having trouble catching a pill chub lately. You don't suppose they're extinct. Maybe it's just me. I think my fishing skills are rusty. Could you maybe fish up a good pill chub and bring it to me? Sure, I'll give it my best. All right, Caesar, I'll see if I can help because that's one of the big things we need to work on, you guys, is actually raising my approval rating with all of our awesome villagers. Also, what's here? Is it a fossil? Oh no, I'm so glad I dug up that pit bull seed before Chatter walked into it. That could have been so sad. Whoops, oh, Chatter. Hey, Siri, I feel like we maybe need more dancing happening right now. Shoom, that's a little better. Oh, so Chatter really likes events. I bet Chatter would really enjoy like a little uh, boom box and we could just like kind of dance around the place. Hey, I've been hearing rumors that you're a bell pincher for Modge. I'm so jealous. I so wish I could be involved in some scandals just to get people talking about me. Ha, huh. bell pincher? What? I, I have spent some good money. I did spend some good money over at um over at Tabby's place, actually. So I do want to visit with our villagers. We need to get our approval rating up. And I just kind of want to see how the story sort of evolve through what they give us. So here is my newly decorated house. I redid some of the things yesterday. We have our amazing floating asteroid surrounded by sapphires, which I really love. We'll have to go look for our gemstone rock today in just a little bit. We have our palm tree, which I'm really glad we got. We have our very first fish catch ever, which is this teensy little pop eye goldfish, which I think is so cute. We have the tulips. So the tulips are what we'll wear, I guess, when we're like doing work in town or if I'm going to be gathering up peaches. I kind of really love the idea of wearing different flowers in my hair, depending on what project I'm currently working on. So right now we're sort of socializing with everybody to try to raise my approval rating with the villagers so that we can hopefully get that first development project that Isabel has for us in town hall done. And I also need to put away a lot of these things. Oh my gosh, I have so much stuff, you guys. Oh, and I haven't even checked on what the rug looks like yet, the ornate rug. And then this is my chef outfit that we managed to get. And I'm actually going to use the chef outfit when I go collect peaches because I like to come up with the fun little idea for the story sake of things that the peaches we gather, I make into delicious peach jam. And that is one of the big ways that I'm currently funding development in my little moss tree village, which I think is pretty cool. All right. So the other things I want to look at really quickly, I've saved looking at some of these things until you guys were with me again so that we could share the surprise together. This is the lady palm that I actually picked out and bought from Tabby yesterday at Tabby's house. Oh, look at that. And it's more greenery in my house. I always need more greenery. So that makes me super happy. I'm definitely a huge plant collector. If you guys have ever seen my vlogs, you've seen I have living walls everywhere. I can't like wait to collect as many plants as possible. All right. And then we also got this manhole cover. Can I display it somewhere? Oh my goodness, it looks so odd, but it's kind of cool. So I guess we could keep that. I'll put it in the train station so that I could use it to decorate at some future point. And then I haven't looked at these guys yet. We have a Botoid. All right, buddy, let's see what you look like. Let's flip you around a little bit, huh? All right, turn around. Are you gonna make some noise? Oh, he makes a little noise. So he's got a little bow tie on. And then let's get his little friend out the timipoid, and then maybe I'll keep one of them to keep me company, because I do, well, they could keep my fish company. What should I name my goldfish? They could, one of them could keep my goldfish company here in the house. And then eventually I could collect as many of these as possible and have a little, <gasps> the museum, you guys, I've learned you can do all sorts of museum upgrades, including having your own display area inside of the museum. How amazing is that? I would love to have my own display. You can like rent your own display rooms and have your own display area in the museum. So I definitely am going to do that one day. I can't wait for you guys to be able to visit me and visit my little town. But there's a lot of work I got to do for the townspeople and if I want you guys to be able to enjoy the visit. All right. So my little house is starting to look like a museum, which is just the way I love it. We have a couple un like unanalyzed fossils. I need to put this pitfall seed away. I kind of just want to get rid of it. Um, let's look at what the paw, pr the paw print wallpaper looks like. Oh my gosh. Oh, that is really cute, actually. Oh, I like the common wall a little bit more right now, but I don't know. Maybe we'll, oops, I didn't mean to grab that guy. Maybe we'll go ahead and put the paw print wallpaper up because that is kind of cute. And let's spread the ornate rug on the floor. Oh, wow. That looks pretty nice, actually. Wow, that was a pretty good find from one of the villagers. I can't remember who gave that to me, but that's what I mean. The items that they give away kind of make a bit of a story to me. And then there's the paw print wallpaper that Isabel made us. Oh, that's so sweet of her. 
And then should I have the common floor for now? I think I'm okay with the common floor, but at least I've got some options, especially for the future. But all right, let's get out of here, you guys. We've got stuff we need to do. Like, oh yeah, find a Pell Chub. So we need to go put some things away, sell some things, catch that little bug. He's taunting me. Let's see if I can catch him. All right, come back here, yay, little buddy. Come back here, little buddy. Where'd you go? Oh, no, you scooched away again. Come back. Hey, hey, get back over here. I got him. <laughs> There we go. Migratory locusts. All right. And there's plenty of peaches, so I can harvest up the peaches later. And here's a fish fish. So let's see if it's the Pell Chub that we need. Oh, oh, oh. Am I going to get it? Am I going to get it? Come on, little guy. Come on. Come on. I need to catch you to give to Caesar. Come on. Oh, my gosh. Pell Chub? A oh, a carp. Okay. Awesome! Well, I can at least do- what? I don't have any room for it? Oh no! <laughs> I didn't realize I was already out of room. That's very frustrating. Um, I'm just gonna drop the pitfall seed. <laughs> We're just gonna leave that there. Alright, and I'll come back for that later. Oh, hey! How are you doing, Blanche? Hello, Siri. It's been quite pleasant today, hasn't it? Quite so. I love how she says quite so. It's so cute. Was there something you wanted? Quite so? What's the latest, my friend? <gasps> Look at that beautiful butterfly! I've got a little pest in my house that I want to get rid of. Oh, not roaches. You know, never. It's my plum. <gasps> I'll take your plum bonsai. I want to put something else in my room, but it's just sitting there. But it's so blah. So if you find anything I can put up there, I'd really appreciate it, Siri. Oh my gosh. Will I ever find you something? Um, what about the manhole cover? Let's see if she'll trade us the manhole cover. Okay, okay, and I need to catch this butterfly. There's just too much going on, you guys. There's just too much, and I have too many items. <laughs> long locust? I'm gonna let go of the long locust. Okay, show it off? Is that just- Oh, that's so cool! I didn't know I could show it off for pictures that way. All right, I'm gonna release the long locust, you guys. And he can go- he can go be a happy, happy locust elsewhere. And I want to catch that butterfly. Because the more things that you catch and give to the museum, the sooner you can upgrade the museum. Raja Brook Butterfly. Wow, that's really pretty. Alright, so we'll put that away. And is there anything I need to sell in the resale store? I have one peach. How did I pick up one stray peach? Who knows? Who knows? Alright. And then let's go ahead. I don't want to knock anything just yet. And we're going to go to the train station. My pockets are too full to put away my equipment. Uh, any notes? Nope, no notes. Let's go into the train station and I will put away the clutter that we've managed to gather up. We haven't even really gotten started with the day and I still need to find like a pill chub. So much going on. I love our village. I can't wait to really get it growing. All right, and then kind of just the random stuff. This is my random stuff. Just no, come back here, butterfly. All right, and of course you can't keep all of it, but I guess I'll just keep as much of it as I can for now. I'll just put those guys away. And then the manhole cover, I'm actually going to see if I can give that to Blanche, whose name, I apologize if I'm pronouncing it incorrectly, it's very difficult. Uh, we're going to see if we can give that to her in exchange. Alright, let's put this away. And then I have so many things to donate and I need to find my beautiful gem rock. Alright, and what's going on in my plaza? Grow my little tree, grow! Yay, look at my beautiful plaza! Oh gosh, and there's something right over here. Is it another, is it another fossil? All right, let's see if it's another fossil. I'm gonna check it. It is another fossil! Fantastic! We are really getting museum upgrades done. So museum upgrades and catching fish for my villagers and talking to my villagers and trading things with them. Let's see if she will take the trade we've got. Well, hello again. Aren't you busy, Siri? What would you like to talk about? How about this? Would you like to take my manhole cover? Uh-uh. What do you think? Trade you for the bonsai? But this won't fit where my plum bonsai is. Sorry, but that's what I'm hoping. <laughs> Something to replace my plum bonsai. Oh, fooey. All right, what about a bug then? Hello again, need something Siri? Uh, you likey? Maybe she'll take a bug instead. Um, I've caught a lot of these long locusts, so maybe the long locusts? What do you think? It's good to have a living creature. Li that's so lively. I suppose I'll have to set up an extra plate for dinner from now on. Oh, that's so sweet. Wouldn't it be interesting to have a roommate like this in my house? Quite so. Oh, that's so fun. 
<laughs> I'm actually giving her a bug. I am so excited. Yes, I'm going to have to think long and hard about where exactly I'll place my long locusts. After all, I want my new roomie to have a great view of you every time you come and visit. Oh my gosh, is she really going to have it? Oh, that's right. I owe you a nice thank you gift, don't I? The, the plum bonsai? No! Oh, it's a stone wall. Thank you. Well, I was really hoping for the plum bonsai, but that's okay. And uh, is this another long locust, like, right here? Did she just, like, release it? Hey, come back here! Aw, oh, he got away again. Oh, man, he's really tricky. Look at him run for it! Did I get him? No, I just got my net caught in a tree. Oh, he's very sneaky. There we go. I'll get better at catching him. The migratory locust. Okay, so it migrated to a good spot, so I didn't catch him. And then pale chub is something I need to catch really quickly. So but we are going to go to the museum today, as we do every day. But it's probably a good idea to go ahead and try to do just a touch bit more fishing. In the hope of getting Caesar's... Oh, that fish just never wants to pay attention to me. In the hope of getting Caesar's fish, the pale chub he needs. So that's Big Top. We might need to talk to Big Top pretty soon. I haven't talked to him for a little bit. Oh, there's a teeny little fish. What you doing here, buddy? I wonder if you can get better fishing rods. I think you can. I think you can get, like, silver fishing rods. I've tried not to peek too much at the guides, but oh my goodness, you guys. That's how I'm learning. There's so much you can do. You can unlock so many different little shops. And when I saw that you can have your own display rooms in the museum, I was so excited. Oh, that's everything I've ever wanted. Because then I can make, like, little custom display rooms. Okay, come on, buddy. Doesn't this look delicious? Oh, gosh. Is it a pill chub? Is it a pill chub? Oh, I think it's another carp. <laughs> Phooey, all right. So I don't know if I'll be able to catch Caesar's pelchub. Oh, there's a big fish. At least I'm catching a few fish that we could sell. I wonder if I could give a fish to Tabby as a gift. I wonder how I can give gifts to my villagers. All right, what do you think, little guy? What do you think? It looks pretty yummy, doesn't it? All right, come on. You're not so little, actually. Oh, oh gosh. Catch, 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 come on. Oh, what did we catch this time? Is it a bass? Oh, a black bass. All right. There we go. So we're catching a few things. A little bit of lively fishing. Oh, and then also where you put your flowers. Caesar, I'm working on it. I'm trying. Oh, Caesar, hang on. Oh, no, my pockets are too full again. Okay, fooey. Well, fooey on that. We're just going to have to go straight to the museum, I think. And let's just take our items over to the museum. And I think Blathers is going to be quite happy. And then we can look for that fossil in between the tree. There's just so much to do every day. It's so much fun. Oh, there's a person back there. Oh, gosh. We'll have to check out what they're up to in just a second here. Let's go ahead and donate these things to the museum. Get that out of the way. But, yeah, building up the museum, that's definitely a huge goal of Moss Tree Village. So, ah, I feel so official wearing my little mayor outfit. All right. Pardon me, Blathers. Very sorry to wake you. I know. Very, very sorry to wake you. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right. Let's go ahead and we're going to make some donations. So we've got a lot of things to donate today. We have a couple bugs. We have a couple fish. There we go. Quite a few butterflies, too. Let's see. Does he need everything? Yes! Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. So he's going to go ahead and take care of everything. Oh, we had an extra, so I can go ahead and keep the extra. I didn't know I had an extra, so that's good. All right, and then he's going to assess these fossils. So we have three fossils that we can go ahead and assess and donate if he needs them. Oh, we have, we're a very fossil-rich peach town. All right. Rare fossils not yet found in our museum's collection. Blathers, I'm so excited! Moss Tree Village seems to have a lot of wonderful fossils. I can't wait to be able like, to put down little paths that look like fossil dig sites. It'll be so fun. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and... Let's see, I want to make a donation? Yeah, I shouldn't be able to make a donation from all the fossil pieces. So we have a skull, a skull, and a tail from different creatures, from different dinosaurs. Or at least flying reptiles. All right, there we go. And there we go. All right, so he's going to handle that. So I'm really happy about that because we have probably grown the museum quite a bit by now. Pardon me, Blathers. We now have given him a fish. How do we get the art? That just occurred to me. Do I need to buy it? I don't know how I get art, actually. 
How do we find the fine art that is supposed to go into our museum, my friends? We have plenty of rooms for them. We clearly have little pedestals and everything just awaiting a museum donation. We've got lots of fossils and we've got a couple fish now and several bugs, but I'm not sure how we are going to be able to expand our art section. That's actually something I've completely forgotten about. Hmm, I'm gonna have to think about that later. All right, let me go ahead and put this away. And then I think for today, run, 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 run. Let's come up and see what's going on up here. Welcome to the H8 Showcase of Moss Tree. Are you here to take a look at our lovely model homes? Sure, what does this do? We're gonna, to begin, I need to know your name. Could you tell me? Oh, Miss Siri. Oh, that means you're the mayor of Moss Tree, right? My sister's told me about you. Your secretary, Isabel, is my twin sister. Oh, that's so cute. Oh my gosh, they're adorable! Oh my goodness, tell me all the cute little puppy stories of your sister. In our showcase, we have models of Happy Home Academy members' homes on display for all to enjoy. If you activate your street pass, you can share your home with other H <laughs> AMP members. Oh my gosh, or HAA members. Designs you're wearing or designs in your home will be displayed as well. Please keep in mind. And that goes double for your TPC information. Okay. Oh my gosh, okay, we're good, we're good. We're good, thank you, Digby. Maybe next time, it's fine. We'll take care of everything. My home is really nothing to show off at the, at the moment, but <gasps> you guys, the birdies say there's something new. What is this? Is this, is this the shop of my dreams? Is this a garden shop? Let me in, let me in now. Oh, I'm so excited. All right, let's see what we find inside. <gasps> Welcome. Oh, a first timer. Welcome. I sell flowers here. Nice, beautiful flowers. Yes, indeed. I also have saplings, tools, and many things. So take your to do take your time and have a look around. Oh my gosh, it's Leaf. It's Leaf, the sloth that has the garden shop. It's the shop of my dreams. I am so happy. <gasps> look, there's a watering can. Yes, I will happily buy the watering can. Oh, no problem. I'm I'm totally gonna take it. Totally gonna take it. Totally gonna use it. This is so exciting. And then he sells little tree saplings. A happy sapling. I'm okay. I don't need a tree sapling right now, though. No thanks, no thanks. I'm good. But I think he also sells flower seeds. So this is where my true work as mayor of Moss Tree Village begins, my friends. Because this is where I'm going to gather up the seeds that I can put flowers all over the village with. This is fantastic. All right, a happy red rose bag, and I will happily take it. He's so happy. He's just like, this is a happy tree. This is a happy red rose bag. Let's see here. That's a happy white pansy bag. The price is, um, ah, yes, right, 80 bells. Yep, and we'll go ahead, and I'm going to buy it, too. I am so happy. It's very nice to meet you, Leaf. And then another cool thing I learned is that you can make hybrid flowers. If you plant flowers next to each other, then there's a small chance, bye little birdos, then there is a small chance that the flowers will actually create a new flower, which would be so fun. And let's see what's at the Nookling Junction today too, to see if there is anything that we might possibly want to buy from them today. Hello, little one. Hi, Tommy. It looks like we're okay. There's a really cute grill and there's a cute bed. I love all the random things that you sell. I already have both the tools. Very nice to see you. Bye, Tommy. If I had a bigger house, I would totally do it, but I don't have a very big house right now, so I really need to upgrade my house. So, so many things. So many things. We now have a new shop. We now have the ability to plant some roses. We now have a manhole cover. We have a whole bunch of migratory locusts and monarch butterflies and carp that I can actually go ahead and sell. We have a stone wall. Oh my goodness. All right. So, I think for today, we have covered so many things. There's just a lot to do. And Caesar wants a fish. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get him a fish. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead. Oh, I have a little watering can now. I probably don't need to carry everything at once. I should probably just carry a few things at a time, huh? All right, let's see what's in this. Nothing in this rock. We're going to work our way over. Anything in this rock? Nothing in this rock. We're going to work our way over to, 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 to retail and sell a few things. And then I want to start a little flower field. So hopefully we can start getting some of those different flowers, the hybrid flowers. Hello, Reese. I wonder how often she updates her shop because I feel like she hasn't updated anything in a while. How can I help you? 
All right, we're gonna go ahead and sell a few things to her. Let's see what catching a whole bunch of these fish fish and the bugs will get me. All right, and then this peach as well. All right, so all together, 1,560 bells. Better than nothing, that's for sure. Fantastic, all right, we'll go ahead and head out. Bye, Reese. So here's my plan. Here's what I think we're gonna do, my friends, is we're gonna be a proper mayor. We're gonna go talk to Isabel and see what my approval rating is, but we're also going to plant some flowers. So I think I have the white pansies, don't I? And then here's some yellow pansies. So we're gonna turn this little section back here into a flower garden because I think people would enjoy the flower garden. So we're gonna plant these. So there's white pansies. And then right here, we're gonna go ahead and plant yellow pansies. Oh, no, I need it to be right next to it. Come on, come on. Let's scoot you over a little bit. It's a good thing they're so easy to transplant. And we'll go ahead and plant some yellow pansies right there. And then I'll just kind of bring the pansies over here and let them sort of stock up over time. And then what are the other flowers I snagged? Were they roses? I think they were roses. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and plant the roses. And then I will gather up roses that we find around town and put them right over here so we can start a little rose garden back here. <gasps> are these lilies again? Oh my gosh, yes. Oh my goodness, tell me these are the lilies. They're the lilies. Okay, so we're also gonna plant the white lilies and the red lilies right in front of my house, actually. Look, here's some more pansies. <gasps> There's a beautiful butterfly. Oh, I wanna catch it. I wanna catch it. No, I wanna catch it. Did we get it? Look at it, a peacock butterfly. Oh, this is so fantastic. Our village is so full of life and so many beautiful things. And we have these beautiful flowers. I wanna put these guys next to my house. And then we can put these pansies up next to the pansy area and we can start a little tulip field. So I'm starting to finally feel comfortable enough that we can start doing some mayor things like organizing flower fields and trying to take care of my villagers. Oh, no, I don't want to wear the pansy. It's very cute, but I wear the red... Or, no, don't plant my lilies! <laughs> I'm just messing everything up. Oh, gosh. All right, let's go ahead and try again. We're going to... Or actually, maybe I want to wear the purple violets. No, I don't plant them! <laughs> Never mind. I'm just making a mess. Oh, gosh. Okay, what I want to do is I want to wear the purple violet. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. That's my new favorite. And we're gonna go ahead and plant the purple pansy right here. And we'll see if that encourages new flowers to show up. All right, and then oh, another butterfly. What a beautiful butterfly day. And then yeah, I don't think you need to carry all the equipment. We'll just wear our correct outfit for the different projects we're working on. Oh, imagine if I had like a little bug keeper outfit. That would be so cute. And then we'll go around and do different things in the village at different times. So let's go in and check on our approval rating. And then I will go look for my gemstone today. You guys don't have to join me. We'll see. All right, we'll see how much time we have. Isabel, come along. All right. Hi, Miss Mayor. Is there something I can help you with? All right, development permit. How are things going? Yes, I would. Are the villagers happy? I did just get a few new flowers. Though I did... I... <gasps> my approval rating is 100%. Mayor Siri, you've done it! I'll submit your application for the town development permit right away. The approval process will take one day at the very least, but it could take up to a few days. If you could come by and check on the approval status from time to time, I'd really appreciate it. <gasps> you guys, we did it! Maybe because we planted so many flowers or because we've been like helping Blanche and we gave her a new bug that is her new best friend. But we've done it! And now we have the development permit. <sighs> I feel so proud of myself right now. I feel like I have been a very good and dutiful mayor and working hard and I'm gonna catch this bug. Get over here, oh, I missed him. Hey, 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 you, oh, I missed him again. It would be, oh, I think he died. I think he jumped in. So it would be really, really fun. Oh, look, there's another butterfly. Yeah, we definitely need to carry fewer items. <laughs> there's just so many, so many things. We could probably leave our watering can away. I like, I'll leave our watering can alone, except in special circumstances. And Blanche, how are you doing now? This is just a bit more fishing than I bargained for. So she's having a good time doing her fishing. <gasps> Let's try out our watering can on this flower. This flower that has become, there we go, a little bit worn out. Do you need, do you need some help? Are you gonna come back to life? I was hoping it would just kind of like, come on, come on, you can do it. All right, are you gonna, are you gonna spring back to life? Maybe? Oh, hey, Tabby. How you? Oh, are you watering everything too, Tabby? Thank you. 
Say, Siri, I think <laughs> I think I like a catchphrase that's a bit catchier. Me wow. Should I change it? I kind of like her me wow though. It's sort of cute. But she does have like a really water-filled house. Um hmm. Kerpow? <laughs> You know what? Why not? We'll make something a little bit more exciting. All right, so we'll go from meanwhile to Ker, and then we'll go ahead and do Pow. So let's see, and maybe meanwhile Ker Pow. There you go. She wants something a little bit Ker Pow. Is that what you mean? Perfect. Wow, Ker Pow. I like it, Ker Pow. Or we should have said Purpow because she's a cat. That would have been kind of cute. All right, so man, there's a lot more you can do every day than I anticipated. And we have peaches starting to show up. So we'll do like a big peach collection. <gasps> My perfect peaches are ready. My perfect peaches are ready. Okay, we definitely have to at least harvest these. And then we'll plant more perfect peach trees. So that's happening. I should probably plant some perfect peach trees up next to the town hall, but I've been planting the perfect peach trees over here next to my house because I figure this is a good spot to make sure that I've got my eye on them every day. All right, and we'll go ahead and bury this perfect peach. And then I think I'll plant like one more perfect peach tree. Oh, hello, anything in there? Maybe one more perfect peach tree uh, right here perhaps. So I'm improving the town quite a bit. I hope everybody can appreciate that. And then I'm gonna save one perfect peach and actually put it in my locker so nothing happens to it. Whew. All right, so my approval rating is at 100%, even if I can't find that Pell Chub for my good friend Caesar. I'm going to see if I can at least stumble on do, 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 at least stumble on that gem rock because I really think those gem rocks are cool. I should probably at some point, oh my gosh, there's so many bugs here. Do I have enough room for bugs? I have a little bit of room for bugs. Just a teeny bit of room. All right, come on. Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna carry as much equipment around. But all right, all right, I'm, I'm rambling way too long. I'm just having so much fun and just getting our village set up is so awesome. There we go, caught the little monarch butterfly. Wonderful. And I kind of want to see, is this the gem rock? <gasps> it is! You guys! The new gemstone! I'm so excited! All right, and which one is this one? A silver nugget. So there we go, you guys. A fantastic day. Oh, and there's a bug that just like literally lands at my feet. A fantastic day of taking care of our village. Now that we have managed to get the gardening can and we've opened up the little garden store, I'm probably going to start actually doing a little bit more gardening around town. Where the heck did he go? Fooey. I'll do a little bit more gardening around town, try to make my villagers happy. We'll start making little flower garden collections where I will specifically gather up certain types of flowers and try to encourage them to propagate and make hybrids. And I will see you guys next time. Oh gosh, there's another beautiful butterfly. We could definitely do just so much in our town. It's so beautiful. Oh my goodness. I love this. I love this. So next time, we will probably be collecting some peaches so that we can try to get the money to fund any of our future projects. And I will see you guys then. Bye-bye.